Today we will see how to draw a pattern using a square. So we go to the PictoBlock interface and start coding a script for pattern using square. So we have our sprite whose name is Toby in a PictoBlock interface. By default, the size of the Toby is 100. Can you see the size? Look at my cursor. It is 100. So I'll make it slightly smaller. So I'll make it 15 and I press enter. So the size of my Toby became smaller. So the sprite became smaller. So I start writing my script. So I go to event and I click on green flag. Okay. Why I require green flag? So that I can execute my program. Then after that, what I require, I require a clean slate. Why I require a clean slate? So that anything is there in the stage should be erased. So I require a pen. Okay, I require a pen. So where I'll get the pen? We need to add our extension. Can you see the plus sign at the bottom? On the left? Look at my cursor. Okay, I have motion, look, sound. Okay, my blocks. And there we have add extension. Okay, click on it. Then search for pen. Okay, we have a pen. Okay, click on it. Extension will be loaded. Then I say erase all. Then I say pen up. Okay, this is my clean slate. Then go to motions and I say go to x and y axis 0. Why I say go to x, x, y, y axis 0? So that my sprite is in the center of the stage. And I say point in direction. 90 and I go to pen and I say pen down so I'm ready to draw a square okay so the first thing what I need to do is I need to create a block so click on my blocks make a block I want to make a block square okay and I want to give an input size and I say okay So how many size, how many sides does the square has? The square has four sides. All the sides are equal? Yes, all the sides are equal. What is the degree of a square? 90 degree. It is right angle. So what I do now? I need to insert codes so that my Toby moves. So I go to motions and I say move move 10 steps say suppose i see okay or i say 50 steps 50 steps okay then what i do i say turn 90 degrees right so once i draw a line it should turn 90 degrees correct right angle so i say 90 degree then i again say move 50 then i say turn 90 degrees right how many sides we became two sides so how many remain again two so i say move 50 steps and turn 90 degrees then again i move 50 steps and i say 90 degrees count how many sides became one two three four how many angles one, two, three, four. Now, I don't want, I want to change my size of a square. So every time if I want to change my size of a square, I need to change this 50, right? Move 50 steps. So I want to make it 100, say suppose I want to make it 150. So again, again, I have to type in all, correct? All the move codes. Here I have to put 100 again I have to put 100 again I have to put 100 okay so to make it easier we have an input called size can you see this size so click drag this size okay click and drag this size and insert on move okay just insert wherever move it is move 50 steps so I give size can you see yes okay what so what I did I gave an input to move so move size steps so what is the size we don't know we have to give a size so i go to my blocks and i say square and what is this 
blank this is size correct so i give you a size i say 50 and i run the program can you see the square look can you see the square small say suppose i want the bigger square i make it 100 here instead of putting 100 100 100 100 in all the steps say move 100 again type move 100 so i gave only one command square i have typed 100 and i run the program my square became bigger say suppose i want 150 straight away i can put and i run the program yes my square became bigger and bigger why because i'm changing the size so this size is linked to this block understood students instead of typing here move 150 steps move 150 steps move 150 steps move 150 steps so i did a shortcut okay by giving an input so i managed to draw a square so i'll make it 100 here and i run yes perfect okay now what i have to do i need to draw a pattern correct i require a pattern of what i have to draw a pattern of square okay so what i do is i require one more block okay i create one more block and i say pattern i say pattern and again i give a input for a pattern steps okay i give a pattern and steps as a input okay now i start coding for pattern so what i do i don't want a square now because i finished the square i'll remove this code and i keep it out okay i remove the code now go to control and say if else okay if else okay then go to operator and i say use this operator okay equal to 50 okay and i say steps if steps equals to 0 okay type 0 okay remove the 50 okay if steps equal to 0 how i brought the steps from the input okay drag it if steps equals to 0 then what it should do it should draw a square okay if steps equal to 0 it should draw a square so i go to my blocks and i say square so what is the size i give for a square okay i give a size i say 75 okay the size of the square should be 75 so steps equal to 0 if steps equal to 0 then it should draw a square what is the size of the square 75 then i need a pattern to okay a pattern of square so i want to turn the square so i go to motions and i say turn 15 degree okay now i want to put nice colors for the square okay every square different color so i go to pen and i say change pen color by 10 okay i say change color pen color by 10 and then i go to my blocks and i call my block okay pattern okay now how many patterns i have to give here for that i go to my operator and i say i take this operator minus okay and i say steps look bring this input down okay how i brought this i'll remove this again look bring this input down step okay place it exactly steps minus one i give steps minus one and then i go to my blocks and i say call my block okay pattern and i close the script now say suppose i want how many squares i need to insert the number say suppose i want 10 squares a pattern of 10 blocks or 10 squares so i press 10 here okay and i run the program yes can you see students see i gave 10 and it drew me a pattern using squares say suppose i say 50 squares 
ओके एना रन द प्रोग्राम लुक हाउ इट इज अंडरस्टूड स्टूडेंट्स से सपोज आई से थर्टी स्क्वेज लुक हाउ इट इज ओके थर्टी स्क्वेज नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू चेंज द पैटर्न ओके इफ आई वॉन्ट टू चेंज द पैटर्न नो वेट हा वट इफ आई वॉन्ट टू चेंज द पैटर्न I change the degree here. Can you see this 15 degree? So I make it mm, 30 degree. Okay, with 30 squares, and I run the program. See the pattern changed. Say suppose I say 50 degree, 45 degree, and I say run the program. See the pattern changed. Say suppose I say one degree. The pattern will change. Okay. So the squares will be closer to each other. So I say around four hundred squares, and I run the program. See, can you see, students? It will draw four hundred square touching each other. Why? Because the degree of between both the squares is only one. Understood, students? You need to change the degree. Try different patterns. You can change the Number of number of uh, these things squares. Okay, yeah. I say I said four hundred squares. Say suppose I say two hundred square. So it will draw only half because they are closer to each other. Say suppose I say two hundred squares and I say here yeah, uh, two degree. See, there will be a gap between both the squares. Understood, students? so kindly practice try changing degree okay try changing the square value which is 75 i will make it 100 i will make the square bigger see i made the square bigger instead of 75 okay and this pattern is number of squares you want in the pattern so kindly practice okay this codes try changing square Size of a square. Look at my cursor. Size of a square. Then try to turn the degree, change the values, see the different patterns, okay, and then put number of square you want in the pattern. Thank you, students.